Hello lovely bookworms, it's Jordan Nicole and welcome back to my channel. Excuse the same outfit in two videos in a row. I am pre-recording today since I look really cute in my holiday outfit with my holiday leggings and my cute boots and my makeup and everything. So I'm looking good today so I decided to pre-record a couple videos. So today I'm doing a short November uh, wrap up and my December TPR. So in November, I already took my books home that I read. Um, I took them home over Thanksgiving, but I read um, The Telling by Alexandra Sarawi and Miss Peregrine's Home for Peculiar Children. I will link my reviews down below. And yeah. So let's get started with what I'm planning on reading for December. So in December, I have about a month off from school starting on the 14th or 15th. And then I come back for training the 9th or 10th. So I have a little less than a month off but I'm still planning on getting a lot of reading done. The only things I have going on is trying to get my driver's license and taking a test. A really big test which I'll be studying a lot for um, and alongside all that my brother is having an engagement party and he's graduating from college so I'm hoping still, even though I'll be kind of busy since I don't really have schoolwork except for studying for the tests I have to take, that I'll hopefully be able to get a lot of reading done in December. So I'm currently reading The Infinite Sea by Rick Yancey. It was really slow at first, but now I'm hooked. And I'm 123 pages in out of 300, and I'm planning on finishing tonight. It is the sequel to The Fifth Wave, also by Rick Yancey. And yeah, I can't wait to read that and tell y'all what I think. <clears throat> So then, after that, I'm planning on reading The Prisoner of Azkaban by J.K. Rowling, which is the third book in the Harry Potter series. My main goal for this year was to finish reading the Harry Potter series, so that is one of my main goals for December. Can I do it? Who knows? But if not, I will definitely finish it by the end of January. And I love Harry Potter, and they're the perfect books to read during the holiday series, and I can't wait to read it. And then, after that, I'm planning on reading My True Love Gave to Me, 12 Holiday Stories, edited by Stephanie Perkins, who wrote Anna and the French Kiss, and it has short short holiday stories by famous authors that I've read before, like Holly Black. Some of them I haven't read before, but Holly Black, Allie Carter, Matt De La Pina, Pina? Gail Foreman, Jenny Hahn, um, David Leviathan, Kelly Link, Mira McIntyre, Stephanie Perkins, Rainbow Rowell, Lainey Taylor, Kirsten White. I've read Steph, um, no, I've read Rainbow Rowell, David Leviathan, Jenny Hahn, Gail Foreman, and I really want to read some of the other offers, uh, some of the other authors, so this is a good way to sample their work and to get into the holiday spirit. Then after that, I'm planning on reading Harry Potter and the Goblet of Fire which is the fourth book in the Harry Potter series. Then after that, I'm planning on reading more of a wintry book, Being Sloane Jacobs by Lauren Morrill, which 
is about an ice skater. Um, she's so Sloane Jacobs, who is a figure skater, um, who messed up during junior nationals, and then there's another girl named Sloane who is a hockey player, and I think they switch places or something. My friend, my best friend, got it for me last Christmas, and I still haven't read it, so I'm looking forward to reading it and see what I think about it. Then I'm reading to read the second book in the Maze Runner trilogy by James Dasner. I started it a long time ago, never finished it. Um, I want to read it, and then I want to watch the movie. So for the books I don't have in my dorm room, I'm also wanting to read um, The Last Star, which is the third book in the Fifth Wave series or trilogy by Rick Yancey. And then I want to read the third book in the Hunger Games series that I've never read. I can't believe it. I know. And then I'm wanting to read the third book, The Death Cur of the Maze Runner series by James Dastner. And then I want to read as many books as I can in the Harry Potter series. Now the ones I actually had in my hand and showed you are the top books I want to finish, but it would be great if I can get to some of the others as well. Um, yeah, that's a short little wrap up, but I have class in like 30 minutes, so I need to get ready and go. But comment down below what you read in November or what you're planning on reading in December. Um, subscribe if you're liking what you're seeing. Um, give this video a like if you read any of these books before. Let me know what you thought about them in the comments. But no spoilers, please, because I haven't read any of them myself. And also, like this video if you're going to get a lot of reading done in December, or if you're planning on it. I love y'all to the moon and back, and I will talk to you later. Have a lovely day, and read, read, read. Bye, y'all.